Every day I, I can talk to my friends, we're talking about, you know, going to the same old places, but I mean, I want to have fun elsewhere. I, I want to go out into a cabin, you know, just have fun in the cabins. Or, you know, I also want to go out to a beach, a secluded beach somewhere on the coastal areas of Georgia, just like Cumberland or Sapelo, so we can enjoy these point, these times instead of just staying in the city and having to put all my money into this club or that club or, you know, go to this spot and that spot. I just want to introduce or debunk the notion that African Americans don't go out into these parks or going out into nature. Here at the Outdoor Activity Center, I have been working as a intern, or we dub the term eco-turn. The Outdoor Activity Center is actually a center, a nature preserve, which is within the city limits. We're working on three major things within the Outdoor Activity Center. One is phase two of rebuilding a bridge, a foot bridge, so we can have uh, people walk over the creeks Part two is a fall garden, since we're in the fall. And part three is trail maintenance. Let's Raise a Million is a project that was started three years ago. You don't have to be rich to go green. You can live in your modest mean home and you can go green. Every month, students around the city of Atlanta uh, in the Atlanta University Center, as well as Georgia Tech, Emory, we get together and we go and we pick a community that we see fit and we give them CFLs in exchange for the Edison light bulbs for free. CFLs are compact fluorescent light bulbs. We were able to reach over 2,000 plus homes, saving approximately $5 million within water conservation and energy costs. So another initiative is I help volunteer with the Georgia Conservancy. It's absolutely critical to have volunteers like James King involved. When I first met James, it was on, it was getting ready to go to Cumberland and, and I really got to know him on Cumberland Island and, and you could see from that instant um, that he was on fire and, and that was kind of where he caught fire was, was in Cumberland. Cumberland Island is an island that's uh, pristine, beautiful white sands, wild horses, uh, albino deer, <laughs> uh, regular deer as well, turkeys. When we was at Cumberland Island, that was my first time going camping and I did trail maintenance, uh, and I came back down the beach and I did beach cleanup. You know, the environmental community in Georgia, uh, unfortunately for a long time, our supporters, they all kind of look the same. And, uh, you know, we've really uh, have our determined